What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into So Real Tea. Um, I'm Lil Perfect, and Amar gets exposed by Sneaky Link after trying to get Maya back. So Real Gang, how are we doing today? Let's get into the video. You guys all know Ray So Wavy and Talia have been dealing with each other for a little while now. Well, guys, yesterday was date night, and they popped out. Even though Talia and Ray has been being real private, every now and then, you know, they bless our timeline with a little great. picture. And this time, it was of their feet, on, but it was definitely tell. given, okay? Ray has just been living her best life, and we're just so happy that Talia can be keeping her happy. She even went went out and spent time with Neek and her friends at the club for Neek's friend's birthday. Let's get into Amar. Yesterday, Amar dropped a video on YouTube where he was trying to get his ex Maya back with the help of his friends. Ain't you no guys way. comment down below and let us know. Do you believe Amar is serious about getting Maya back? Or do you think he's just doing it for good content? Remember the last time Ain't I reported no that Jazz said that she was trying to get Crystal back when she wore that shirt? And then Amar stated that he felt the same way and he felt as if he should get Maya back as well. Well, guys, this is the second video. But that y'all been seeing me. So it was one that caught my eye, though. It was one that caught my eye. If y'all do remember, not too long ago, Jazz did a video with, you know, saying that she wanted her ex back and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So it was one that caught my eye that pretty much, you know, wanted me to get Jordan reaction and I guess Jazz reaction. So I'm going to get both of their reactions on this. So as y'all can see by the title, pretty much says that Jazz is convincing me to call my ex and sing love songs. I'm literally gonna call the number. I don't know if we're gonna go to voicemail. I don't know if she's gonna answer the phone. But we're gonna play pretty much play it cool. I'm gonna sing, you know, sing some love songs. Nigga covered up her whole tattoo. Broke up with her on a pan comment. <laughs> Cause she says she ain't know nothing about it. Broke up with her on a pan comment and they just done. I wouldn't answer the phone. As long as I know, and we're going to get a reaction out of both of them. Like I told you guys in my last video about this, I genuinely believe Armar may miss Maya. But what do I know? In the video, Maya finally answered the FaceTime and she stood on business, guys. Like, I'm not going to lie. She did not fall for it and she spoke her mind and I just love that. It seems like Maya has someone sending her flowers. Maybe it could be Amar trying to make up for lost times. Or do you guys believe it's someone else? Leave your comments down below and let us know. Please, please, please. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Uh, um, okay. yeah, you, you doing, you doing good? Um, yeah. Uh, I, I wanted to, um, I can help you get better. Um, I'm kind of stuck right now, but I, I wanted to uh, sing you something. I just wanted you to hear me out. Um, cause I've been feeling the way, you know what I'm saying? You know, I kind of miss what we had and what we had going on. And I just miss your presence, your presence and everything. So, uh, beautiful, I want you to, I want you to hear, hear what I got to say. <laughs> Oh, As the night moves in, As the night love takes on a new meaning. Niggas play too much. If you oh, were here, Maya, you would know what I mean to say. You know, listen to let me sing the lyrics, man. The circle stands for what you say. Why you not saying this? Okay. Even though we're not together, I still need you to know what I mean to say. Like, I'm really trying to get you back. Like, I don't want to lose you. I only yeah. want to love you more, more. Oh, yeah, she done hung up on oh. Yeah, because what are we doing? And why are y'all in the background? Oh, mama. I wouldn't call that, but that is me. Call back. I, I mean, I'm not that. I, 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 I mean, my. Uh, so, so, um, why did you hang up? No problem. I I'm just trying to see. I'm just trying to see. Uh, just look at this. Oh. Oh. Wow. In the car. In the car. Oh, mama. We was calling to see if you want to save 15 more of your car insurance. Um, no, it's that so, uh, so you so, so you're not yeah, gonna stop talking to me. <laughs> Did you know Geico you could get? Bro, she's talking, man. Let me. Like, I think what, what, what was you? What, like, what was you thinking? Yeah, I'm in my car. What was you thinking when you did what you did? Say what you that things could be better. That's what I'm saying. Like things can change. Like I know what I did. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody who's standing right there with you. I got good credit. Wait, 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 wait. I'm a good co-sign. What? <laughs> what? Wait. Run that back. I said everybody who's standing right there with him 
What's your name? 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 Um, I stayed around as long as I could. I tried with you. You shut your hand. You shut. Oh, hang up the phone. <laughs> hang up the phone, brother. Walk the out. Please hang up the phone. Now you gonna just reject my brother for all his. <laughs> I mean, this nigga load is stupid. He's been doing perfectly fine without me. No, he hasn't. Look at him. He got gray hair. I mean, that's probably now. Oh. Now it's probably the time for him to feel how he made me feel. No, I'm gonna need you to put your big no. dog. It's so crazy to me because right before Amar dropped that video, someone reached out to me and sent me screenshots of a young lady on Instagram saying that she and Amar. Tell Amar from FOE, send my back, send my back my bread. Send me back my bread, I guess, from that birthday gift I got him, or send me back my bread. He weird as F, only Amar. Huh? used to mess around recently and she sent Amar a gift for his birthday so i'm guessing they're not on the best of terms anymore that's crazy and she, that's definitely some 20 year old shit to do he stayed um, y'all niggas probably still doing that at 40 and 50 think that she wants her <laughs> money back she yeah i can't blame her because if you're gonna play on my top please run me my funds but then again guys you always have to know if you're sitting here doing something nice for someone and you're buying someone a gift or giving them money because you're being kind then if it doesn't work out that's just your loss and, and it's now their gift you gave it as a gift <laughs> you know sometimes you just don't, don't worry i done took a lot of shit back you know what i'm saying back in the days um but now i, I, I won't take nothing as a matter of fact you can have all this shit everything cool with me gotta eat that so hopefully she's either able to get her money back or move on from it but you guys comment down below and let us know what you think last night amar and maya were both on twitter tweeting some questionable things had people wondering were they subbing each other Amar tweeted, promise I don't care enough to lie to anybody. Then he carried on and said, if I got to ask more than once, just forget I even asked. Then okay. he stated, I don't care how hard you search. It's only one of me ready to catch a flight. Need to get the F away. While on the other hand, Maya was on Twitter. She stated, go with your move and make it your best one. If my feelings involved, shit will and can get wicked. Cause uh -oh. just leave me alone. If the conversation getting shorter, it's getting longer with someone else. Oh. She retweeted a post that stated, God removed everyone who wasn't really for me. I'm beyond grateful. Hello. That's a fizz act. <laughs> then she stated, if you stand for nothing, you'll fall for anything. Everything. Never trust a ninja who wake up. <laughs> Don't trust a ninja Damn. that wake up. It's crazy. <laughs> After his last tweet, Maya retweeted a post that stated, Guilty and delusion would have a person thinking everything you say or tweet is about them. But you guys go ahead and comment down below and let us know what you think happened. I hope they're not talking about each other. Let's get into Amar's best friend, Jazz. You guys all know Jazz dropped a video recently where she had her ex Crystal on a shirt and was acting like she wanted Crystal back. Well, guys, since then, Jazz and Tay's supporters have not been feeling it. For those of you that don't know, since then, Tay has deleted Jazz off of Instagram. They no longer follow each other. A lot of the supporters Lord, are on Twitter God. still going on about this whole thing. A lot of people but why? are speculating that Jazz is mistreating these females that she's talking to. <sighs> Someone took to Twitter and stated, you're going to make them girls commit suicide because you stay playing with their feelings. That same page tagged Jazz again and stated, India stays strong and don't Jazz abuse Tay. Don't kill yourself dealing with the Jazz foolishness. Yo. I don't like that statement. I don't know why. People would think that lady is trying to commit suicide 
or anyone, but that is a serious matter. And because that's some shit that they would do, y'all gotta stop projecting what y'all would do on other people. We need to take you know certain things that they say <sighs> serious because you guys don't know how that could hurt somebody. We all know India be on Twitter and she's you know sometimes she tweets lyrics from different songs, so you guys never really know how these people are feeling, guys. I do not believe that girl wants to commit suicide, and personally, no one knows what these people are going through behind the scenes no one knows if jazz is actually mistreating india just because people see that she's creating content with other females and not claiming her on the internet doesn't mean they aren't locked in you never know india and jazz may have some type of agreement and have some type of understanding Someone tweeted Jazz and stated, what goes on in the dark will come to the light. Like the way that Diddy beat on Cassie is what you did to Tay and other victims. What? <laughs> Where did that come from? That's crazy. I can't wait until she tells what really happened in that house because it's never too late to tell. I remember seeing that swollen eye who were also oh, tweeting girl. jazz and stating that she was abusing Tay when they were in a relationship. Now, guys, those are some serious allegations. Nobody can pass. Oh, friend, how you just have Chris Brown come in this bed? <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> uh, I guess these are videos. Please do not go back because that would Okay, I don't know if she realized she did that. Okay, and then I couldn't even hear. Um, yeah, I'm not going to insinuate somebody just putting their hands on somebody. That, what? <laughs> I'm done with this video. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.